Okay, this is one case study. I okay, have a this question. is one case study. Okay, so please read this uh, case study. And uh, as a FSEO consultant, we need to analyze the enterprise structure in this case study. Okay, so just uh, read out this case study. And just now we explained about uh, uh, SAP enterprise structure, right? SAP FICO enterprise structure. Okay, so so how we can uh, how we can define that important uh, areas which uh, we need to configure based on this scenario. So just read out and tell me. So how many company codes are there? Okay, how many plans? How many business areas? So just uh, read out this. Okay, and uh, I will ask you one question. So once the uh, uh, case la study is completed. Right now, sir. Yeah, right okay. now. Just to read out this case law. Okay, this case study just to read out and tell me how many uh, companies are there, company codes are there, plans are there. Just to read out. Okay, so just to explain what you understand. That's it. Okay, can anyone please tell? Uh, can anyone please tell me? So, what are the points that you have noticed in this case study? There Anyone? Only one company code design. Okay, there is uh, one company code is there. Next. And and there is two business areas. Okay, two business areas are there. Next. One plant is there. Next. In the plant person truck gym shit for. Sorry. Okay, I will tell you. See, so Tata Motors Limited is a registered company as per company sign. That means, so it's a company. Company means one company is there. That the company name is Tata Motors, right? It has two manufacturing units. Car, car is a manufacturing Gurgaon plant. Bus, bus and truck is manufactured in Jamshedpur plant. So here, once you observe. There are two kinds of plants we have. One is a Gorgon plant and the second one is Jumpshed. OK, so car is one kind of division and bus and truck is one kind of division. So one purchase organization, purchase organization comes under the MM module. Plants will come under the MM module. OK, so plant creation will be done by MM consultant. So like that, so purchase organization uh, creation will be done by MM consultant, right? So one purchase organization. Purchase organization means so uh, procurement activities. So purchase organization just like uh, all the procurement activities will be carried out through purchase organization only. Okay. One purchase organization does the procurement of material, services, and asset for both and company code. Company code is only one. Okay. Separate purchase group. Purchasing group means purchasing group. Group of persons who who are responsible for procuring activities. This is also concerned with the MM model. So like uh, the company, company code, business area, functional area, these are all configuration will be done by FI consultant. But uh, in SAP MM also, so plant creation, okay, and uh, um, purchase organization creation, purchasing group. Purchasing group is just like 
group of persons who are responsible for procuring activities who are responsible for procuring activities so so this is also done by mm consultant and here maintained for gorgana and jamshedpur plants okay some materials is imported from outside india okay outside india some of the materials are importing and tata motor sales sales means sales organization so the tata motor sales is product through dealership so dealership and domestic market these are the distribution channels this is also comes under the sd module okay some of the configurations are comes under the mm module and some of the configurations are also comes under the sd module some of the configurations are comes under the fi module okay it is also exposed to product outside india okay so there is only one credit control area is there okay only one credit control area is there so here uh, we need to analyze the business requirement so first we need to understand the business process then we need to analyze it okay see how we can map into sap system so here we need to define a company okay we here we need to define a company okay so company is a t0 151500 this we need to define sap system okay and company code 1501 we need to define in our company uh, in our configuration settings business area we need to define one is gurgaon and jamshedpur and credit control area this part will comes under the sap fi module okay and plants this part will cover under the mm module divisions will cover under the mm module divisions are just like cars bus truck so these are all divisions right so sales organization will be comes under the sd module distribution channel will comes under the sd module sap mm purchase organization so this is purchase organization also comes under the mm module so that is the reason i told you guys so first of all as a fico consultant we need to analyze so uh, what is the business process of the client and then so how we can segregate that business process into different kind of uh, um, segregate to different modules like fi mm sd so people who are from sd model will collect their information fi model will collect their uh, respective information so here fi related stuff are only company code and business area and trade control area right so these things we already discussed right now okay so this is just like analyzing the business requirements of any client okay yes, so now you got it right some uh, areas you got uh, idea yes, okay guys i will share you one document here we do not okay. define the segment as it is product manufacturing company so here, so here there is no de- segments okay here no product is going it's just like uh, divisions not a product so maybe that uh, segment is like bikes cars uh, may, maybe we can also treat as a segments okay so they will exp- they will tell you so uh, once you connect to the your business so they will tell you how many uh segments we have those things they will inform but bike is also one kind of segment okay car is also one kind of segment see uh, selling uh, selling through uh, selling through uh, that we showrooms okay showroom is a distribution channel okay so like that car and bus is here some uh, segment products no yeah yeah Uh, so we have not defined means we will define how yeah we see that we need to identify first what are the products here the bikes is also one kind of product right so finished product it's a final product that is uh, one of the manufacturing unit for manufacturing units uh, how many plants and how many business areas and how many purchase organizations distribution channels divisions okay these are all stuff we are analyzing as a um uh, fico consultant we are uh, just analyzing our requirement so respect to consultants we will analyze their requirements okay uh just uh, share uh, i will share you one document to you enterprise structure okay some of the configurations uh, are not there in the system uh, so uh, uh, see just now 
profits enter i explained uh, and uh, uh, financial management details i explained those things are not uh, uh, not there in the document but anyhow just uh, uh, watch out this uh, video once again and get the knowledge okay and uh, uh, just uh, make some notes in your uh, hello books okay sir? yeah am i audible yes ma'am yeah sir i have a doubt sir you were explaining about the company code okay uh, there you have mentioned that we need to follow like a legal and local requirements of the company yes so you meant to say that uh, th those uh, legal and local requirements is it given by the government of the particular country or uh, suppose uh, no, no, no. company see, in india yeah uh, see uh, generally you can say let's say if you are located in uh, hyderabad your company your company is located in hyderabad okay so we need to follow the legal and local requirement i told you legal and local requirement who will provide the legal and local requirement so some of the legal requirements will be provided by our central government okay so how to prepare the financial statements who will tell you so based on the uh, based on the chartered accountants of india so ica institute of chartered accountants of india so they will give you suggestions they will give you recommendations and uh, with the nekas there is separate team will be the nekas okay so both will be clubbed they will give you suggestions guidance recommendations for the accounting perspective okay for uh, taxation per perspective there is a uh, one more separate uh, entity will be there cbdt central board of direct taxation they will give you suggestions recommendations modifications whatever the requirements will be given by cbdt regarding taxation perspective okay for company law institute of chartered institute of uh, company secretaries of india so they will give you suggestions recommendations how to prepare your financial statement which is, which is in vertical uh, vertical way or horizontal and uh, board of directors uh, information so all the company legal and uh, local requirement company preparation and all they will take care and for uh, controlling perspective costing the institute of cost accountants of india okay they will give you some suggestions modifications standards company uh, sorry costing standards they will announce they will guide you okay so all these things we need to follow to prepare the financial state some of the local governments okay they will suggest you guide you okay that the guidance and uh, uh, suggestions we need to also follow so overall government regulations we need to follow that's it got it right okay thank you sir okay guys sir i will this is yeah and as you have said that uh, every functional consultant will do his own configuration so as it is integrated system so impact will be on means configuration of mm or uh, consultant at the impact on fi consultant also so in real time uh, this is done by coordination or what uh, how we, how it is done see uh, as a fi co consultant you should focus only on the sap fi areas okay not the mm and the sd areas so in real time so you need to configure only fi related and co related but not mm related and sd related okay but your company has given any authorization to do mm settings also and there is no mm consultant is available only fi consultant will take care entire aspects of mm also that case you need to perform mm related aspects and you need to do the configurations and you need to resolve the issues it depends upon the company to company some companies will allow you to create a configuration for mm some, some of the small configurations for invoice related or purchase order related but some companies um, do not allow to fi co consultant to do the configuration of mm okay because already mm consultant is there already sd consultant is there but in real time so fi is integrated with the mm module and fi is integrated with the sd module and fi is also integrated with the pp module and sap fi is also integrated with hr module so that case for integration perspective 
so respective teams respective cross module teams will participate and will involve to do integration activities integration related configuration so that case whatever the basic configuration which are vital for fi perspective only those areas we need to configure with the help of mm consultant sd consultant pp consultant hr consultant so rest of the things will be handled handled uh, handle by respective team members so if you are completely a uh, sole responsible for fi related aspects only not related other things thank you okay have you got it okay yes sir. right okay guys so this is end of the session okay and uh, tomorrow tomorrow is holiday because you know um, ganesh ganesh festival is there right what we call ganesh chaturthi uh, yes yeah. ganesh chaturthi festival vinayak chaturthi in telugu okay so tomorrow is a festival so i don't want to disturb you and we make uh, another session in the uh, wednesday in uh, so in wednesday we will take another session okay so that like uh, that uh, day we will do all the configuration in the system we will close the infrastructure configuration in one day okay so very easy uh, not much uh, difficulty okay so this is uh, today session thank you Sir, sir, hello. Yes, we need to have server. Yeah. Hello. Sir, I have a question. Yes. Uh, the do, uh, the case study that you uh, saw today. Uh, mm -hmm. So uh, from that case study, we found that uh, some configurations were there for FI and some configurations mm -hmm. were there for SD and some were MM. So okay. who will analyze these things, sir? Who will analyze ourselves? FI consultant will analyze FI requirement. MM consultant will analyze MM requirement. SD consultant will analyze SD required. Okay, all the people will uh, gather together at the initial stage. Okay, at the time of business blueprint, so okay. all the consultant will participate. Okay, that time they will analyze. Okay. Okay, got it. Thank you, sir. Okay, this is coordination between the teams. Sir, this how will practice? How can we get server? Hmm, sorry. Sir, how we will access? How can we get server access? Okay, so those things we will get it tomorrow. Uh, Kadar sir will share you one number. So please get the server access uh, immediately. Okay, server access they will provide you for three months almost. Okay, they will charge one thousand. Okay, so just uh, they will uh, our uh, teammate will uh, uh, connect you in the chat. Just uh, contact respective teams. Okay. Thank you. Good night. Have a great day. Thank you, sir. Same to you. Thank you, sir.